Welcome to Tripedia, where we embark on an incredible journey through the tropical paradise of Phuket, Thailand. With its stunning beaches, crystal clear waters, and vibrant culture. So grab your sunscreen and get ready for an unforgettable adventure in this tropical paradise. Banana Beach. Banana Beach is rather large, with shallow, clear blue waters, towering palm trees, and superb sand quality. It's a mystery why it hasn't been developed in the same way as the rest of the island. It's not completely desolate, though. There's been a restaurant there for as long as I can remember. If you don't know where to search, Banana Beach is difficult to find. Most tourists struggle just to identify the little entry from the road. The ideal route is to drive to the airport and then, at the T-junction, turn left rather than right as you would for Phuket Airport and then follow the signs to Nathan Beach, which is also quite nice, and drive a few more kilometers. Greenheart Garden Greenheart Garden is a great hidden restaurant set high on the hills above Kata Beach and blessed with incredible panoramic views of the Andaman Sea. The restaurant is designed with numerous large wood terraces with bamboo furnishings and is completely encircled by forests. The ambiance is quite soothing and the staff is extremely pleasant. Bon Island or Koban Bon Island or Koban is located just south of Rawai Beach in Phuket and is only a short long tail boat ride away. Few sandy beaches dot the island's coast and despite being so close to Phuket, it has yet to be invaded. During the day, just two beaches on Bon Island are occupied. Pyeong Prai Pyeong Prai is a fantastic local eatery in a lovely green setting near the well-known Bangpei Waterfall. The atmosphere is light and airy, making it a unique location to unwind before or after seeing the waterfalls. Pyeong Pari delivers excellent Thai cuisine at reasonable pricing, including some regional specialties. Bang Pai Seafood Bang Pei Seafood is another of our weekend favorites in Phuket. Bang Pei Seafood offers a variety of delectable local meals. Sit in front of a natural scene of mangrove trees growing into the water, a setting completely off the usual path. Wat Phra Nang Sang Wat Phra Nang Sang has an unusual history. Interestingly, it is Phuket's oldest temple and reputedly has a relic of Lord Buddha, though I'm not exactly convinced about this. Wat Frasnang Sand is notable for its strange statues. One was a massive black statue of a revered monk named Luang Porchim, but the body proportions were so off that the figure was demolished. It didn't take long for them to remove it, along with other monuments of mythical giants with their breasts exposed and holding machine guns. The temple remains stunning, with numerous paintings to appreciate, including a reclining Buddha. The Kathu Museum The Kathu Museum is a new addition to the list of Phuket museums. It debuted quietly and without fanfare, yet the house is stunning. It is worth a stop on your route from Patong to Phuket Town, or vice versa. The museum shows an intriguing list of the most common Phuket meals, spices, and ingredients. This house was part of a beer company distribution and had been vacant for a long time. In the meantime, look at the map below. More Mu Dong Dong More Mu More, one of the most popular and talked about but difficult to find seafood restaurants in Phuket's eastern mangrove. It's fantastic and enjoyable, and you get a real taste of local life. Everyone knows that Andrew Zimmern from Bizarre Food tried it, and you should too. Wat Khao Rang Wat Khao Rang is another sitting Buddha of Phuket. Not the big Buddha, but the original and first sitting golden Buddha on the island, built long ago on the hillside of the famed Khao Rang Hill in Phuket town. Many individuals in this area are also unaware of this magnificent shrine. Samet Nangshi Viewpoint Viewpoint of Samet Nangshi. This spectacular vista, which is also located in Peng Na Bay, has grown in popularity. Of course, it has gotten popular and potentially congested as with any newly discovered destination, but it is still worth the journey. A very early hike to Samet Nangshi, located well above sea level, will provide you with a stunning sunrise photo around 5.30 a.m., 
approximately 75 kilometers from Patong Beach and 25 kilometers past the Saracen Bridge that connects Phuket to the mainland. Black Rock. On the road to Naiharn Beach, Black Rock is a relatively new viewpoint located a bit further than the well-known Karen viewpoint. The issue is that it is difficult to reach and locate through a gravel road. There is also some climbing through the forest, but the view from the summit is well worth the effort. As an added bonus, if you reach Black Rock, you will also find the elusive Nui Beach, which is even more difficult to find, but well worth seeing. Wasa Homemade Bar There are numerous breathtaking viewpoints surrounding Phuket. Still, Wasa Homemade Bar has a terrace where you may relax comfortably high above Patong Beach and watch the famed ever-changing Phuket sunsets while sipping a chilled drink. Thank you for joining us on our travels around the world with Tripedia. We hope that our videos have given you a glimpse into the incredible diversity and beauty of our planet. We believe that travel is not just about ticking off destinations on a bucket list, but about immersing yourself in new cultures, meeting new people, and creating unforgettable memories. As you continue your own journey, we encourage you to explore with an open heart and an open mind. Whether you're traveling solo with friends or with family, every trip is a chance to learn, grow, and connect with the world around you. Thank you for being a part of the Tripedia community, and we look forward to continuing to share our adventures with you. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more travel inspiration and tips. Until next time, safe travels.